everybody how much we love bodybuilding and i think that that'll shine through that's all we need to do good keep the team tight keep you know really come you know watch each other's backs and stuff and make sure that you're kind of supporting each other and you'll all grow you'll all grow as a team then and indi and, and as individuals absolutely yeah um, absolutely no we've uh We've established the right kind of team, and and like you said, the companies and everything that are around us as well are are perfect companies to be, um, yeah. you know, helping promote us, making us better, and giving us content as well. You know, so it's, it's all just fallen into place to be perfect. Had any advice from Phil Heath? Um, you know, he's been around a lot. So uh, one of the big things was right before I did my pro debut, I actually got uh, my hernia fixed. So. Um, I had surgery, what was it? It would have been like 22 weeks out from okay. uh, Texas, 23 wow. weeks. So I had hernia surgery and gyno surgery. Um, and I I was born with my hernia. It was just a navel hernia. Um, and that was actually something that Phil had advised. He said, hey, man, just go get a fix now. While it's early, it's not big. It, it's going to grow. Um, it's inevitable. Mm. Uh, you know, that's what his started out as and it ended up getting bigger and he had all the issues. So he said, go get it fixed now and they can do it with three or four stitches. Yeah. Uh, and you know, so I went and got that fixed early on. Um, I did that. I had six weeks of recovery after surgery, started prep 16 <laughs> weeks out wow. uh, and, and went straight into it. And so you know, I, I mean, that was another factor. I, I don't I don't make excuses and I don't care. So that's not something that people really need to know or anything. But I know that next year hmm. um, you know, I could go into a dieting 24 weeks if I wanted to um, or, or something along those lines. So I know I can be better in a lot yeah. of different aspects. Um, but it was something that needed to be done. I wanted to get on stage with a flawless physique um, as far as those things went, as far as blemishes go. And uh, those were fixed, and I'm really happy with those. I, my belly button, um, I really think, helped tighten my waist up a little bit mm -hmm. um, as far as waist control goes. So I was happy with that, um, you know, and it was just – it was a necessary evil. So that was something Phil advised. Um, he's been around a little bit less now, uh, but, but just a great ambassador as far as, you know, yep. helping Brett and I and, and telling us, you know, like, really just that we were good enough just to keep going you know yeah that that's uh, and and coming from him obviously you know it's just, you know it's he don't give no fluff so nope um it's always nice to have him around but it in the gym alone is something that's like you know you you go in there and you go to train mm. um you know it's like well we won this one's had seven titles one here there's no messing around today it's you yeah. know it's work it's time to earn them so um it, it, it's just really a cool environment that he's created and and dylan especially mm. um is is amazing you know he helps us pose he helps us pick whatever equipment we want we tell him we want it he goes and gets it for <laughs> us so because th doesn't he give you all your own offices i mean dorian hayward's got his own office there phil's got his own office yeah. i think brett's got his own office yeah <laughs> yeah brett and i are in an office together actually wow, yeah so that's great uh, we're all together there and and it's it's just a perfect environment man it yeah, really is sounds like it here with denver